Hey guys, I hope you're doing well. We are at a lawn that we are just now going to start taking care of here in Holiday. We're looking at these spots here. They were using an existing company and they were saying that these spots were from drought stress. When I got here, it's definitely not drought stress. Let's talk about what to look for. There are, we've talked about this time and time again, when you walk through the yard, you get these little white grayish moths that fly. They stay nice and low to the ground and they're flying all over the place. That's a huge indicator of sod webworm. So basically what you're gonna wanna do, I'll flip the camera around. You're gonna wanna go to these areas and do a tug test, not just up top. You're gonna wanna grab it at the bottom and peel it back. You will notice how easily this peels back. I don't actually see any sod webworm, but these moths are flying around all over this yard, which means the moths the moths are the adult version. As these sod webworms become adults, the, they turn into moths and fly away. But the big kicker is these moths lay eggs in the, gra in the grouse, grass and the ground, and then next year you're likely to get them again. So if you have this issue, get it treated with an insecticide or let us help you out. We'd love to help you out. Hope these tips help. If you have any questions or need help, we'd love to help you out.